and welcome to Unit of Time. If you don't know what Unit of Time is, it's where I take this, which is a wheel of uh, categories, and I spin it around, and depending on what it lands on, you will get that sort of information straight to your brain head thing. All right, so here we go. It's a question. And the question I had, or found at least, was, uh, can a star turn into a planet? And the answer, surprisingly, I'll scroll down to it, is yes, a star can turn into a planet, which I did not know. I mean, I knew about different types of stars. There's only one type of star that can actually turn into a planet, and that's a brown dwarf. If you'd like to know more, go ahead and look that up. Um, despite what it sounds like, it's not actually a race, racial slur. So, yes, a brown dwarf star. Um, just check that out. There's also something called a black dwarf, and I suppose that would be cool enough to walk around on. I'm not sure that would be a habitable planet either, but those won't form until stars start burning out, which isn't going to happen for a very long time. So, um, yeah, there you go. Uh... Well, that's all the time we've got here on Unit of Time today. So, uh, I hope you learned something or found something out that was enjoyable. And if you didn't, um, you can complain to your congressman, I guess. Um, they probably won't be able to do anything, though, since I don't actually talk to them and they... There's no real communication set between them and me. But, um, you know, I hear that's a thing to do right now. So, yeah, why not? All right. I will talk to you later and take care. Bye-bye.